Hey there everyone, welcome to today's video. So today, I'm going to talk about Ignite, the world's first transaction fees back protocol. Ignite blockchain is a public, permissionless, Ethereum virtual machine compatible blockchain running on the world's leading proof-of-stake consensus mechanism. Ignite blockchain isn't just a platform for recording transactions, it also can execute smart contracts computer programs that directly control asset transfer between parties with objective and fair logic. Ignite blockchain has been designed to be compatible with Ethereum, the most popular smart contracting platform. Any contract or application deployed on Ethereum can also be redeployed on Ignite in minutes. So the question still remains, what is Ignite blockchain? So Ignite blockchain is a series of records, time-stamped and immutable, operated by decentralized servers, also known as nodes. A blockchain protocol defines how a network or nodes communicate and how blockchains are added to the chain. There are, of course, various breeds of protocols, each one deploying their own fit flavor of performance and incentives. Regardless of the favor, flavor, uh, blockchains share invariants that can be used as foundations for building new economic systems. Through cryptographic algorithms, data contained within the blockchain is codified and immutable, meaning that it cannot be changed or deleted. The very nature of blockchain is that they attempt to change an earlier transaction would create a, a cascading of effect through the rest of the chain, breaking consistency. This feature provides for a tamper-proof record that can be used to represent anything from bank balances to the results of a political poll. More advanced protocols like Thundercore have if this then that logic trees to enable programs called smart contracts. While some protocols are permissionless, allowing any computer to join their network, and others are permissioned, maintaining a vetting mechanism to only allow approved computers to participate. However, most, mm, almost all blockchain protocols exist as an open source software project. Like Thundercore, these protocols are building economic systems. Furthermore, a blockchain profits from allowing as many developers and participants as possible to access, review, use, and develop its code. That way, any consumer, developer, or business can, all, can use the protocol, build on the network, and add value to the system by de deploying their services on top of it. Open access ensures that the barriers to entry are as low as possible and encourages as many new players and entrains into the field to compete for users, improving the overall value of the system. This is it for today's video, hope you liked it.